This nigga is a fool, bro. Take our bitch. Man, I'm in the elevator. They all like, you look familiar, man. I'm all like, you on that show, huh? You Hollywood. I'm all like, yeah, that's me. He, oh my goodness. Him and his wife, can we get pictures? I'm like, yeah, you got it. You got it, man. Now, nah, oh no, mother. What's going on? It's your boy Jordan Ray. Everybody know me as Hollywood Ray. Make sure you don't miss out on that first episode. From start to finish training day is uh, wake up around seven, run the hills, get you a mile and a half in, two miles, run some sprints up the hills. And after sprints, we hit the weight room. Get a good lift in, uh, dumbbells, bench press, squats, all type of stuff. And after that, you get you a nice breakfast in, you know, with the family. We all eat at the table. Then we go to the gym. Go to the gym for about an hour and a half, two hours. Drills, scrimmage, one-on-one. You just get a nice sweat in, you know, conditioning. And we come back, grab something to eat, lunch. We relax for a little bit longer. We, hey, we, me and him go mellow and jello. Never. What? Never. Bro. Bro, first off, this nigga jello's 240. I don't <laughs> care, bro. 240. What six, that seven. mean? He's shooting all ones? No. He yes. ain't getting no tools off on me. He's shooting all ones. He's posting niggas up, too. And if it's winners, niggas might not touch it. Man, he, For real, bro. He be on that. Bro. And then if he missing, you on, like, on his back. We could go. We could go. Me, Jaden. Ram versus LeVar, <laughs> Bello and Jello, nigga, what's up? And we back to the gym. It could be a light training session or it could be a, a, a tough training session. That's like an everyday thing. I would have passed out. <gasps> they, was, they was cold anyway. <laughs> <laughs> this dude Fox just dropped the whole oh, thing. Hey. <laughs> he dropped all the boneless tenders, bro. <laughs> Come on, Ramsey. Jermaine Jackson, I mean, he the guru, he the guru. Like, he knows the game, in and out. He been there on the big stage. He know what it takes. He know what you have to eat. He know how your body have to be. You know, I'm thankful for Jermaine. Well, I've been knowing Jay Rage, I mean, since he was 13, 14 years old. You know, kid from Detroit, I'm from Detroit also. You know, and uh, Jay Rage is a hard worker, man. You know, his game changes every year. He adds him to his game every year. And he's one of those kids that, you know, laugh, nice, funny, you know, and just want to make it. He's want to make it, and he's willing to do whatever he got to do to make it, whether he's standing in the gym seven, eight hours, you know, on the track, running the hills. He's willing to do whatever he got to do to make it in life as a professional basketball player, and I'm right there with him trying to help him make his way through. Uh, I think it's going to be a good event, you know. you got the top prospects over the world coming, playing against each other. You know, it's the All-American Games, the first annual BBB All-American Games. So it's definitely going to be exciting. I want to see how it is. And I feel like it's going to be a show. Melo didn't get to play against Oak Hill or, you know, certain schools. You know, some of those players are here. I know they call it an all-star game, but it might get a little intense. So I definitely want to see that. How much is for? Never lost. We spend 24 hours together, literally. Uh, he's basically, we basically act just alike. So as soon as we met each other, we kind of just clicked. And ever since then, you know, years, it just, anything, like he can ask me for anything. He you know he got it. I asked him for anything. He always got me. Like blood couldn't make us any closer, honestly. Jay Ray is like, like I treat him like one of my sons, man. He was one of them goofy ass kids that was loud and obnoxious. Could play though. And this was in the JBA where I met him. And he brought him to the house and he ain't left. One of the reason he's, he's genuine, he's a hard worker, he's gonna go to that next level. I treat him like a son, my, my boys treat him like a brother. And he'll do anything for us and we'll do anything for him. I gave it to the youngest nigga out there. Oh, for real? I wasn't gonna give it to no ground nigga, I'm sorry. He's a tough kid. Hurt his ankles, still play. Hurt his thumbs, still play. 
I see Jay Ray just needs opportunity. Being as young as he is, that boy got his body a little bit better, a little bit bigger, understanding uh, uh, how to be a man and not be a clown. You know, he's like, hey, I'm Hollywood Jay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we get all that, man. Bro, I'm trying to come back. They like this. Can you have oh, 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 oh. So he's just gonna get he's gonna be provided the opportunity to make some money playing. Uh either overseas in the pros somewhere he's gonna make some money playing ball. A Romeo, Romeo Wings, committed to DePaul, 2019. Top 50 in the country. Uh, we play uh, AAU together. Uh, it's my little brother, yeah. little bro. Uh, it's like, no, that's big bro. He's been looking out for me, you feel me? Uh, we just do a lot of stuff together. We used to do a lot of stuff. That's my man. So I always talk to him, always hit him up, all that. Uh, I feel like a lot of people slept on him, but now he got a name for himself. Uh, and then I feel like he's gonna go to the league, he's gonna do well. Now everybody wanna come around and stuff, you feel me? He's been working hard and it's gonna show. Uh, he just been working, he played the JBA, uh, played with people with LeVar and them. And his skills just showed it off. All right, Philly on his way right now? Yeah. All right, bet, I'm about to pull up, take a, uh, yeah, I'm about to take a shower. You yeah, sure? Yeah, nigga. How, when I haven't been at the hotel? He got a lot quicker. Um, shot got a lot better. Just good looking out throughout all the years. Just good looking out. He ain't never changed up on me. I ain't never changed up on him. I mean, I mean it's a lot of nerds, though. You feel me? My nigga Philly a nerd, bro. I love him. Ah, just play. Ah, just play. You know you my baby. You okay? Like, good thing they ain't using no uh, sound, huh? What's going on? Chilla. Hey, pull up on me. Come to my room. What's your room number? 961. Uh, Alright. Alright. Hey, Philly the King always get me right. You feel me? Uh. Oh, he he check, he check. You feel me? Even the barbers stay lace, you feel me? We always stay lace. That's all I'm gonna say. You gotta make sure you put the triple B's back on. Hey, big baller brand to the end, you hear me? Everybody be like, man, how does it feel being this? How does it feel being that? Like at the end of the day, man. At the end of the day. I'm a normal person, man. We all have the same 24 hours, you know what I mean? You think you Hollywood for I didn't give myself the name Hollywood, you know what I mean? And I act nothing like I'm Hollywood. You see me out, I definitely speak to you, ask take a picture. You know, I'm there. I'm there for it all. From you here. did the switch, but then I reversed that bitch and switched again, and then it was supposed to be on me, but you had another switch, which allowed your ass to play. But you just <laughs> fucked yourself up, huh? Aha! <laughs> about switch! Who won, nigga? He's talking about. <laughs> Dumb as hell. It's on you. If we put a hand swap, last card. Uh -huh. He had nothing left. <laughs> but he has to swap with somebody. Yeah, yeah, like, no, I mean, nigga, it's not I down. That's what I'm telling you. No, it's not down. It's not, thank right. you, my nigga. Uh, thank you. Wait, wait, wait. You better stop saying oh, shit. Let me put oh it down, God. nigga. You should have just waited a little. Exactly. Now, oh no, motherfucker. <laughs> hey, you gotta say. Gang. <laughs> just work on being uncommon. You know, work on being that uncommon worker, work on being the 1%, not blending in on everybody else, not just because he, he's one of those guys that if guys don't go to the gym, he's still going. You know, he's one of those guys, so right there you got to edge. You know, but, it, but it's a difference of going to the gym every day and going in there every day, putting that for real work in. And when you go in the gym every day working in that manner, that's where that uncommon situation comes in. That, and now when you face off against that guy who's supposed to be the king or the champion or, you know, I got to get through him to, to break through this wall to get to the next step, you right there and you prepared to be ready. Because one thing I always tell him, control the controllables. You know, and, and I tell guys all the time, you just can't love the game. A lot of people say, I love this game. Yeah, shit, people that don't play love it. But you got to be in love with this game. I see myself being, uh, MVP of the league one day. I see myself being the next Steph. I don't want to compare myself to Steph because I want to be the best version of myself. But, you know, I see myself being one of the best players in the league. Hey, Ray, you all right, boy? You know you got to get your ass up early. My man. Hey, man, appreciate you guys, man. Thank you. Thank you get so you. Much. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks a lot, man. Peace.
Y'all the easiest people in the world. Yeah, that was great. Y'all ready? <laughs> 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 ready? I'm some little bro, Jaden Hardy, man. Number one shooting guard in the nation. Hey, come on over here, man. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, off white only, you know how we are. Look good, play good. You ever heard that? All right, so I don't need to do the outro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's a natural outro. Be Hell yeah. All right, try to get that off. Turn around on me. Come on. <laughs> bro, here you go, bro.